buying a car apparently isn't very simple. When you have an out-of-state license and you are buying a car in a different state, apparently the rule is, and you can call around and ask any dealer if you don't believe me, they will not take more than $2,000 on a card, apparently. The $3,000 card definitely didn't happen. It had way too much mileage. All these lights were on it. It needed a lot of work. It was in rough shape. It was going to be like the Mazda situation all over again, needing repairs all the time. The good cars that would be okay are a lot closer to about $9,000. I'm working on it. The problem is I cannot take that much cash out. I can only withdraw $1,000 a day. So it's going to take several days in a row of pulling out one to get this done. So please be patient with me. Nobody's getting scammed. The car is getting bought. I'm not being rude. You have to understand I'm being very overwhelmed. I'm getting constant. If you look at TikTok, it's a whole bunch of shit about me. Like, it's hard to open this app. It's bad for my mental health right now. That's all it is. I promise when I got the car, there will be a video. And there will be. But they're making it very difficult for me to make this happen. I have nobody I trust to just give that money out of my cash app to. And will hand me the cash to go do it. I don't have a bank account because I'm homeless. I don't have an address to use to get a bank account. So my only option is pulling out $1,000 a day until it's all together and I can hand it to them. So that being said, please be patient. Give me a few days to get this together and you will see me in a car. Trust me, I wanted this to happen days ago. Every day I don't have it, I'm not working. It's a very stressful situation. I suffer from anxiety, bipolar. So if it seems like I'm being rude, I'm not. It's a lot to handle, especially when you have several people attacking me. They're not all good people that come in the live. So going live is very stressful. It's not me yelling at everybody. I'm very appreciative of anybody who has helped me with even a dollar. So before people jump the gun and start doing more damage to me, I don't need it. I'm going through enough, please. A scam is falsifying what the money's being. It's been very stressful. Like I've not been able to eat, sleep very well. It's been a rough few days. So I'm really sorry. I've been being bombarded. It's hard to get back to people. I keep getting banned and it keeps getting me blocked from messaging and doing anything. But I do want to let you know, I do appreciate everybody who has helped. But as you saw, I already lost $6,640 and I'm not trying to trust a stranger again to help me. So please be patient while I get this money out and get it done. Listen, buying a car apparently isn't very simple. When you have an out-of-state license and you are buying a car in a different state, apparently the rule is, and you can 